Welcome to Resident Evil Village. I watched tons of playthroughs of the previous game, Resident Evil 7, and I loved it. I just saw so much of it, though, that I didn't think there was any point in doing a playthrough. I feel like a lot of the... I don't know. I feel like a lot of the excitement from watching it was from seeing people's first time reaction to everything happening. However, when I heard about Resident Evil Village, I made sure not to spoil myself. So I have seen somebody play through the demo of it, but I believe the demo is a completely self-contained thing. Um, other than that, I just know that there's a big tall vampire lady who's really hot and everybody wants them to step on them. I'm, I mean, I mean, I'm in the same camp too. Please do step on me. But beyond that, I know literally nothing that happens in the game at all. So let's jump into this completely fresh, huh? Can't wait to see what fucked up things are going to happen. Going to start a new game. Um, I do have a game that was already started. Just played for like two minutes in the opening level just to make sure that all the settings were set correctly. Let's do standard. Let's do standard. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Bat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. 
If I remember right, we're... Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. If I remember right, I think we're playing the same character as, as the main character in the previous game. I can't actually remember his name. Was it Ethan? I know the wife's name was Mia. Yeah, definitely you can't blame her for not wanting to remember what happened. So when I was testing this game out, I just I just took um took the baby upstairs. And that's all I did. I didn't look around the house at all. This game is so good looking. I can already tell I'm going to spend so long just staring at how good everything is and like reading the brand name like like what are the brand name on those diapers? Natural Sense. 28 diapers. Ages 3 plus. Cartoons. I don't think they're watching, but maybe they'll like the sound. <laughs> I'm supposed to put them to sleep, but I'm just going to take them on a little stroll around the house. It's our favorite pastime. Kitty cat. Oh, I don't think there's any zoom in. No, whoa. I don't. What did I just press? Oh, X. X makes us turn uh, do a 180. There could be a button to zoom in, but I don't know what it would be. She's going to grow up beautiful. <laughs> After playing Amnesia Rebirth, I'm like, hold X to comfort and look at the baby. Oh no, hold X to do a 180. A little different in this game. Once things warm up, we can go for a walk. You hungry? No? Maybe later then. It's so good looking. God, it's so beautiful. And this game is not anywhere near on high, by the way. It's on probably like roughly medium settings. Roses, food, February, the sixth rice cereal, banana puree, seventh sweet potato puree, boiled spinach and cream. Ethan, don't give her any sugar or honey and no mushrooms. It says mouse wheel to... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Can't zoom in very much. That's it. Her birthday will be here before we know it. They grow up fast. Let's just enjoy it while we can. Let's see if we can say hi to Mia. Hurry up and don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. Okay. Sorry. Formula doesn't look too bad. Like I said to your mom, that book's too scary for you. Your mom and I love this song so much. The music box grandma gave us for our wedding. Almost there, honey. Oh, are we? Well, definitely not going there then. Every door but. 
Yes, you come into the shower with me. Nature's milk. Revitalizing toner. Oh, show me the inky list. Oh, sprays. Mia's medication. She's been on a strict regimen ever since the incident. Yeah. After everything that happened, I'm sure she has a lot to deal with mentally. Why do I even keep this around? I should get rid of it someday. It's creepy. Weren't bobbleheads a thing in the last game that you had to like shoot? I, I don't remember why. I don't know if it was just a collectible or if it actually meant something. This is like the spare storage room kind of thing. <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. <laughs> Historical look into the architecture of Eastern... Oh my god, the text disappears so fast. Eastern European Castles and Keeps by George Trevor. Curtain closes on the Dolby gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Dolby toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Ah, oh, is that the official cover up on what actually happened in the previous game? Jack Baker, 57, and his family who were exposed to the gas perished. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was the family from the previous game. Ethan Winters and his wife are also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Hmm. This is the official cover-up, so this happened... I mean, this even says there was a full investigation into the... Um, into the thing. So this is a while after, and at the time, Ethan Winters and his wife, their whereabouts were unknown. So did they... I wonder if they got new identities? I wonder if that was part of the official cover-up or something. But yeah, maybe they have new identities and they're living a new life. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Yeah, I mean, most people reading in the newspaper are just like, okay, a small accident in some place where, you know, I don't know anybody. Didn't happen to anyone I knew. Kind of just a, why would you remember it kind of thing. Good cover up, I suppose. February 6th, 2021. Mia and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly. But I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much, at least. I know Mia knows this, too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Oh, I like that. When you go back and forth on the pages, because it's on a computer, it makes the sound of, like, pressing a key on the keyboard. That's really cool. Yeah, and then when you close out, it makes like a, a mouse clicking sound. I assume the papers made like crinkly noises when we were flipping through the pages. I don't actually remember, but I would bet. 
Yeah, they make papery noises. Cool. Oh, the uh, birth certificate or something like that. Birth something for Rose. Rosemary Winters. Hmm, Winters. Okay, so that is our last name. Like, I guess we didn't change names. Um, date of birth. Yep. Height, weight, screenings. All results show no issue. Patient is in good health. Results for additional fungal pathogen tests will be provided by BSAA, Applefield or Applefeld Memorial Hospital. Rose is fine. Yeah, after the previous game, I could see why they would want fungal pathogen tests. <laughs> See, we couldn't have done that if we put Rose down to sleep before exploring the house. Gun survivalist, a heavy firearms... Heavy firearms manual for field combat situations by Joseph Kendo. Yeah, no, I would want to be armed after what happened. No, oh, wedding photos and stuff. <laughs> I wish it could stay like this forever. So I wonder how things waiting. She's scary when she's angry. I wonder how things do go wrong. How do things go wrong again? Time for bed. It rolls. Beautiful. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. I can move around faster. Can I do anything that I couldn't have before? Probably not. I know Mia's not what she was in the previous game, but I'm still scared she's going to turn into that other thing and just start stabbing our hand again, you know? She is cooking. She has knives. Just really, after the previous game, I'm just really sensitive about Mia and blades. Mia and blades and hands do not go together. Finish putting her to bed yet? Suppose I can turn this off. Oh, this food looks great. What do we have here? Looks like maybe baked potatoes. I don't know what the rest is. Actually, I don't know if this food does look great. It, it looks kind of weird. Actually, it is actually quite weird. But there's some sort of like dip in bread. That looks good. Maybe some pickles that might be. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. Mmm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de legume. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. <sighs> you really have to stop worrying. It's just... Finding you in Louisiana, 
the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <laughs> Oh? Mia, get down! Mia! Well, Mia's fucking dead. Oh, God. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? Why? Go move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Rose. Hey doc. hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. We'll be there. That was the that doc. Was doc. She'll see us see next week. week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just won't. Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not walking around the wall. Fuck. What the hell happened to you? Okay, so what I'm getting from this so far is that that was a military operation and they wanted to, I don't know why they wanted to kill Mia. Obviously they didn't have to. I mean, it's not like Mia was a particular threat. So I, I don't know what that's about, but obviously their main goal was to capture Rose. And then obviously something went wrong while they were extracting us, while they were transporting Ethan and Rose.
I love the faint glow of that red light. Useless. Mission objectives. Eliminate target. Recover body. And secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Yeah, so one of the objectives was to kill Mia. And take the body. Move the two Winterses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. Sounded like in the meantime we had been learning about firearms and had received military training, so perhaps we're better able to defend ourselves than we were last time. <laughs> that sound of the blinker is so cool. Steps leading up here. Careful. Yeah, that looked pretty rusty. Okay, just some rocks falling. Hmm. Hmm, that's abnormal. That's also weird. Growling. Yeah. What the fuck happened here? Okay. Which things? They kill the fish too?
It's so fucking dark. Save some water. Something upstairs. Maybe it was below us? I don't know. Maybe... It, I hope it's above us because we're going down, so... Let's go away from the thing, please. Hey. Oops. Wait, what did I do? Oh, Q also makes you do the same thing as X, I think. Huh. I was trying to lean around the corner. I don't know if leaning is a thing. Okay, that food's looking a little old. That plant's looking a little dead. A lot of garlic. No, no vampires. That's a little eerie. What's that? It looks sort of like a fetus. Like something growing in the center. Oh my god, I love how I'm just... I love how everything looks. I'm half scared and half just admiring the labels on everything. Ugh. Oh, there's going to be something behind me when I turn around, isn't there? Mm. Is it daylight? Is it daylight? What did all this? Do we have a lost time thing going on, or did the sun really rise that fast? God, this game looks so 
good. It looks so good. Everything looks so different in the light now. That's where we came from. Can't go back out that way. Yeah, something just burst through the entire wall. And that wasn't made of particle board. Those are full logs. Vista. Oh, it's even a windmill. It's beautiful in like a gothic sort of way. I'm guessing that's Lady, what was her name? Dimit I don't know how to pronounce it, Dimitrisk or something like that. I'm guessing that's her mansion. Or castle? Is that a castle? I guess it's a castle. broken eggs. This is still steaming, like they just left, but I think they've been gone for a while. I mean, these potatoes, <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's just an old box of potatoes and they had forgotten about them for a while, but those are overgrown. You can see they're starting to sprout. An easy to pick lock. Guess we're gonna get a lock pick soon. Yeah, like somebody came through here and just like tore things up. Something incredibly strong. Mm, another one of those symbols. There's that again. That was something dragging a body. <laughs> Ethan's really lucky not to have been caught by any of them yet. Or by it. I don't I don't know if there's multiple. I don't know what the fuck it is. Need some kind of other item. Looks like he needs a crank handle. Shh. 
shackles? Okay, that's a little weird. I don't think they kept animals in here. Whoa. I feel like I'm supposed to shoot that. What is this doing here? Yeah, wait. It's not the toy we had at our home. That symbol again. Every scene in this game is so beautiful, I just want to go photo mode and just take pictures of everything. space to try to jump to peer over but seems to be guard Yeah, this is where we saw the body being dragged. It was here. It was dragged that direction. Which, of course, is where we need to go. Goat heads. Okay. This thing's running. It's idling. Roughly. What happened? Workshop, graveyard, cer ceremony site. Locked due to missing homeowner. That's definitely breakable with a knife or something. Some force could break it. Shit! Oh, we're locked in. <laughs> Our first weapon. That is awfully small. First aid. Are we hurt? Looks green, so I think we're fine. Fully heals all wounds. <sighs> uh, 
Not sure what right click is. Right click is like a... It almost looks like a block, but it's not the same as space. Space is definitely a block. <gasps> All the jars can be moved. Did they just run out of the house? Not even a single body. No, no, friendly, friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road. And... What's going on? Oh no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! Take it! Are they werewolves, maybe? I think they're werewolves. Dead body? Wait, there's more. Here's everybody. Jesus Christ. What the hell is wrong with this place? It's right over there. It's right over there. It's right there. Always oh, with the hands in this game, in the last game. I love to just mangle the character's hands. Fucking Christ. Ew. What was that? No. Oh, dodgy. Uh, uh. Uh, fuck. Yeah. What the hell? I don't trust they're dead. Okay, I think they're dead. Okay, I think there's some sort of auto aim on. I just want to turn that off. Aim assist. Turn that off.
Oh yeah, for a family photo. I don't think that's gonna open it, unfortunately. As nice as that is. I'm proud of myself, I didn't even get a hit. We can do crafting. With um, with an herb and chem fluid, we can make a first aid med. Might as well do that, right? Oh wait, no, we're we're missing the herb. Treasure. Yeah. Oh damn! Breakable glass. There's the herb. Mm, F. I love the frost on the glass. Or, or like the condensation actually is what that is. It looks so good. Ugh, our hand. Ew. Fuck. Okay, hold on. What is our health? Our health looks fine, but I mean, that don't look fine. If I use the healing juice, is it going to be magical healing juice that will restore our hand? Bolt cutters. Yes. I'm gonna get the hell out of here. How's this game's save system, by the way? Has there has there been any saves? Mm. Locked from the other side. Radio inside, it sounds like. Nothing. Ammo? We might. I. I think if I don't miss too much, we have enough to kill another one. Oh, there's even blood on the gun. Holy shit, that is some detail. Okay, we have a bunch of ammo now. Hmm. Oh, there's a... There's a lot. I, I I don't think we're gonna be killing these all. No, no, fuck no. 
Uh, you can barricade, barricade doorways. Cool. Uh, I don't think we have anything to barricade this with. Get the fuck away. Running. Okay, well, they're dead. Drop money? Cool, I'll take it. Is it over? The radio's back? Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my... to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? <laughs> Ugh, God, stop showing me the hand. I don't like it. It's a bad hand. How are you not screaming in pain constantly? Well, I mean, I guess... Adrenaline. Oh. They're just... Watching. What the fuck? I mean, it's not that they haven't spotted me, obviously. They're... They're avoiding? Wait, are they? Maybe not, because it kind of looks like they just, like, are coming for me. Are they, are they coming for me? I can't tell if they're just, like, observing or actually patrolling. I think they're just observing and keeping, keeping their distance. Shortcut. They're backing away from me. They're backing away from me. They're keeping their distance. Oh, that one's not. Gunpowder? Okay, I guess I can Damn make ammunition. Oh, fuck, a shotgun! Hello. Okay. How much ammo we got for this thing? Two. <laughs> All right. Attack flower bags to create... Create something? Cover, I think? Uh, I don't, I don't know. Do I want to... Hold on, do I want to go down there? I guess? The fuck is down here, though? Gah! Oh! Let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Oh, sweet. There's no end to them. Well, that's very explosive.
Well, um, I almost got a fucking weapon. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 now. Uh, what the hell? Cool. Got some treasure. I think we just got a hit. Oh my god. The hunt. Uh... I guess... To fucking... Just run. I guess. Just going in a circle. Down, 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 down. Hmm. Yeah, this was not the way to go. No, no, that really wasn't. That was handgun ammo, that was not worth it. What the fuck are you? Oh, 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 no, come on, come on. I hope it's close enough. Uh... No, I don't think that worked. Locked. Mm. Fucker. I don't think I have any healing left. Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm fucking dead. Oh, you meant to die there. either meant to happen or this is the most elaborate death animation ever. Oh, those jumps. God, they're so cool though, aren't they? Like, I mean, not just the big one, but the smaller ones with weapons, riding horses. It's fucking badass. Creepy badass fuckers. Ugh. The healing juices have not helped matters. <laughs> it's better. Wait, wait. I think they just saved my life. I just got an achievement called Not Liken This. Like in like L Y C A N, lichen, lichenthrope. Can 
Can I craft? Yes, I can. In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose! Yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming! <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again. <laughs> Rose is here? That's a Dark Souls laugh if I've ever heard one. Can I craft ammunition? Just handgun ammo. And I don't have enough rusted scrap even for it. See, so yeah, is there a save system? Or is it just auto saves? I don't know. There's a save system in the previous game. I assume there is one here. Maybe this is the save system. Creepy symbols. Where, where's that chem fluid? Ah. Oh, great lichens, the fabled monsters, wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh. May they come to tear us apart. No, I don't like that. Easy to pick lock. Oh. I think we have access to the village kind of proper now. Now we have some tools, so we should be able to like open some things with the, the bolt cutters and our guns and our knife. Oh, and looks like M opens the map as well as V. M is a lot more intuitive for me. Although I know V is closer on the keyboard. Ceremony site. I really don't like that. Ah, yeah, Castle Dimitrescu. Or Dimitrescu? Something like that. Aww. Cute. We offer these goats of warding to protect the village and its people. Any who break them shall feel mother shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. Wait. Are these collectibles? Should I break them? It says don't. But that's also kind of inviting me to. Um I'm scared. I'm not. Uh, I'm not going to. Please protect me, goats. Stronghold. Yeah, that is 100% a fetus thing. 
Also, yeah, we are quite hurt. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. Okay, no, there's a goat up there. You're definitely supposed to shoot them. Achievement unlocked. Cynic. I'm sorry, you're goading me to. Pun intended. I don't know why I shot that one. I should have knifed it. Waste of ammo. So am I going to feel Mother Miranda's wrath? Wait, show that to me again? What was that? A piece of a relief with a carving of a beautiful maiden. Hmm. Hello. Meant to slot into something, surely. <gasps> That's her! They're like eight foot tall or however tall lady herself. Hmm. Um, how do I rotate? Left click to rotate? Uh, I mean, do I have to wiggle it? I don't get this. I guess I'll wiggle it into place. <laughs> Should disaster fall upon the village, seek out the crests. One is in the care of the church. The other is at uh, Louise's house. Now, the church is where I'm at, right? And we just, yeah, we just got the one crest. And we were already headed to Louise's house. They had the radio message that there's safety there. They can help. Aha! Uh -huh. Our first save point. Yes. <laughs> what a cool looking typewriter. Lexington. It's too bad there isn't a more like involved animation when you go to save. There's some really nice sound work though when you just switch between the slots. And back out. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, well, I think that's a good place to stop for the first episode. They make you wait a while for that first save, but um, yeah, this game gets going quick, huh? It's like, oh, everything's fine, you baby, and Mia's dead. Okay. <laughs> and you're kidnapped. Whew. Yeah, um, hope you've enjoyed so far. I, I certainly have. I'm into this a lot, um, and I'll see you for the next one.